exclusive, a heartbreaking discovery we made at a historic Miami cemetery. Many graves there have been desecrated. Local 10 News reporter Glenna Melberg is there live now with the exclusive for us. This is such hallowed ground. So much of Miami's African-American history is buried here. Evergreen Memorial is also now the target of grave robbers, and that is heartbreaking, especially for those with a personal stake here. This had happened over the weekend. See that concrete corner smashed off to Arthur Kennedy. It's a sign they're coming back. When they're taking the bodies out, it's something It's crazy now. Now you're coming with blue gloves. You heard right. They come prepared with surgical gloves, vandals to start, and worse, Grave robbers in one of Miami's oldest cemeteries, Evergreen Memorial Park, where some of the city's most important African Americans in city history are buried. You see a suit and a shirt. See clothing. Though much of that traceable history is lost in neglect, decay, and now crime. And there's no telling why they're doing things like this. Kennedy has been searching for his great grandma's grave here. He does what he can, when he can, sickened to see fresh damage, bones stolen. And right there's a rock where this vault was open. The casket was wide open. I see both, both of the wings, both of the arms, they were lifted open. And I seen a lady, it had to be a lady, I seen some beads, and I also seen a leg there. We saw feathers, signs of animal sacrifice. It's a spiritual thing, a voodoo, and getting the bones out of it. But mostly damage and theft. The family that owns the Miami Times newspaper bought Evergreen at a foreclosure. There is little funding for upkeep or security. This is historic ground. I mean, I don't see no way. Is the funding or whatever it may be? It has to be saved for some apparent reason. It shouldn't be like this. This is an issue with no answer really at the moment. Kennedy envisions maybe historic preservation, documenting the family history here, maybe even tours. But right now, all they want to do is keep the grave robbers out. I'm Glenna Milberg in Miami, Local 10 News.